Hello and welcome. Welcome to the Sims 4 Single Sim Challenge. My name is Ajax Post and this is episode 6 of our adventure, where we're actually not interested in those three people at all, uh, but in this little chappy here. Uh, the Single Sim Challenge is for me to raise a single sim that kind of it says what it does on the tin. No, it does what it says on the tin. I, whatever. You know you know what I mean. Um, so this is our guy, Barney Slade, and it is my task to raise him from toddler to elder uh, without giving any commands to any other member of his household. He's still a toddler. We've got a few days left um, in that life state, if you will. Um, and we're doing reasonably well so far. And I wasn't actually going to start at this point because they've all just gone to bed. But as I was preparing for the recording, something quite remarkable happened. Uh, well, not remarkable in the sense that, um, whoops, <laughs> that his sister, uh, here she is, uh, Barbie Slade, had found a monster under her bed again. This is, I think, the second night in a row. Now, the last time it happened, she spent the entire night trying to get her parents to parents to deal with it and it appears that today they are so even without me doing anything they're actually turning into moderately good parents but we shall see um as i was sort of preparing for the recording uh, adam here her father had sort of been given the task to go and check for monsters um but in whatever i was doing i was just checking the recording levels he appears to have forgotten that that sort of task but Barbie has now woken up her mother, Amy Bond, who's <laughs> gone to sleep again. <laughs> oh, these are, no, Th these really are terrible, terrible parents. <laughs> no. Oh, that is, no, that monster is still there. You can hear it growling under the bed. And poor old Barbie, uh, is she is hungry. She has had no rest for over a day. She is totally fun free. Um, and her parents are blissfully unaware. Where's, where's Adam gone? Is he, is he play, he's playing a game again, isn't he? Well, he's doing anything apart from looking after his daughter. Barbie, are you going to get, get your mother awake? No. Okay, now this is probably going to go on all night, so I'm going to skip, as I was intending to do, uh, through to the morning time when uh, our main man, Barney, wakes up. What do you... What do you... Oh, that's nice, you see. So Daddy's checking in on him, just making sure everything is all right. Um, <laughs> I did not... Oh, I'm sorry. I... I can't cope with this this level of um, ineptitude, inadequacy, oh. and total. <laughs> they're, to, they're totally unprepared to deal with 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 the situation. Oh. Maybe they're scared of pair of monsters too. Oh, well, that that would be that would be terrible, wouldn't it? Anyway, yes, I'm going to skip through, so I'm going to run this for a, a moment, and in and you'll see a a really sexy video effect, possibly. <laughs> and I'll, I'll see you in the morning. And so, here we are, in the morning, and Barney is up, and he's hungry. Is he going to tell anyone? Oh, I think he should tell Mummy. Um, right. Food, please. Yes. And her response is... Ah, okay. So, yeah. Unfortunately, through through that night time, um, poor Barbie did attempt to communicate with the monster. Did attempt to communicate with her parents um, several times, and every time they simply ignored her. Um, oh, so she is feeling well, awful. Basically, very hungry, no energy, and no fun. She's going to have a great day at school. I also noticed, and I'm not quite sure when or why this happened, but the fridge is disintegrating and there's a puddle of water on the floor and nobody appears to be taking any 
any action to correct it. It's all very strange indeed. Okay, so we're just going to have... Oh, and they haven't emptied the potty from yesterday either. Running a single sim, a toddler single sim, is obviously fraught with difficulties because um, he can't fix things. And uh, he relies on his, or he or she for that matter, relies on their parents uh, for... Uh, bath, please. Thank you. Is anyone going to give him a bath? Actually, does does Amy have work today? She had work yesterday, I think. Oh, she does. Oh, well, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Now, the thing is, do um, do Sims. So I'm, I'm not a regular player of Sims 4. I only come in very occasionally, so I, uh, there's lots of game sort of processes I'm entirely unfamiliar with. Do they actually fix things all autonomously? So... I'm sure in The Sims 3 they would mop up puddles without being told. Uh, whether they would fix things like broken refrigerators, I don't know. He's taking out the, 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 the rubbish, or as some people might say, the trash. They'd be wrong, of course. And there's Barney in the bath, having a grand old time. And she's actually bathing him, washing him. That's good. If you remember that uh, there, was a, there was one moment where... Adam tried to bathe Barney and basically just basically just dipped him in the water and then pulled him out again. It wasn't that wasn't entirely successful. Okay, so um, presumably Amy Bond will be going to work any sometime soon. Now, do we have a toy box here? We do. So he will play with. Ooh, Chompy the Monster, Purple Protector, the Purple Pursuer, Tessa the Triceratops. Oh, a speedy sports car. Well, let's go for Therese the Triceratops. Um, Amy, you're supposed to be going to work. Oh, th she's got 36 minutes. <laughs> I assume that she will disappear off there when the time comes. So what's Barney going to do? He's level four of the imagination skill. Oh yes, how he can read toddler books. Actually, let's just check his skills. We need to um, get to the top of at least two skills as part of the single sim challenge. So imagination and communication, he's doing very nicely in indeed. Movement, a little less so. Potty, I think there's only three levels in that. So he should succeed and fulfill that one quite soon. Today, I imagine. Oh, look at that. The imagination's going wild. Um, should we <laughs> take his clothes? No, let's not do that. He's carry on playing with the toy. That's fine. Spend a few more minutes doing that. Oh, actually, does he have needs now? Oh, he does have a bladder need. So, actually, he can do the potty on his own, can't he? Amy's off to work. That's good. And uh, Adam's just sat in the kitchen, musing quietly to himself. Uh, so we'll ask Adam for potty help. I'm not sure that's an entirely sensible thing to do, mister. Doing your press-ups in the kitchen whilst there's presumably water on the floor and um, an electrically no. dangerous <laughs> a sparking refrigerator where's Barney? oh he is coming downstairs at last, good uh, so he's getting some movement, oh we should be level 3 movement anytime soon Oh, it's a long way down these stairs. I'm hoping that he'll be able to um, manoeuvre and uh, get up and down the stairs somewhat more easily once he gets to the next next level of movement. Right, so he's finally getting to his father. 
who has been remarkably idle. So, Daddy dearest. Give me potty help. There we go. Um... No, don't talk. I want potty. Oh, um, don't want that. No. I'm going to have to click on the potty again. There you go. Yes, what is that puddle of water in the kitchen, Daddy? And does it not look at all dangerous to you? Apparently not. Right. No. Yes, potty! Yes! Okay, so we have what we used to call an opportunity, or something. <laughs> breaking news. Amy's boss asks her to drop everything and watch for a possible breaking news story, but she's really, really busy. Should she focus in like she's supposed to, We'll just go about her day and hope she catches it when it happens. Well, it's the boss. And bosses can be a bit a bit iffy like that. If you sort of work on your own initiative, they might not sort of um, be terribly appreciative of, of, your, uh, of your action. So we will focus in, because that's what the body does. Typical, it was a false alarm, nothing happened, and all that time waiting was time Amy could have spent writing. A small performance loss. Oh well. So the boss's fault. Okay. So yes, we're using this uh, already full potty. Stop laughing, Daddy. This, this is ridiculous. <laughs> but I can't do anything! I think if it, if it explodes, I might be able to replace it within the rules of the challenge. I hope. <laughs> but, uh, right, so how's he doing? Oh, look at that. Oh, okay. So his uh, needs are dealt with. What's he going to play in? Oh, he's playing with a frying pan. <laughs> what do you want the boy is doing? It's all part of thinking, though, apparently. Whoop. Something's happened. It's a goofy look. Um, did anything happen? Did Adam do something successfully? I have no idea. He's watching the telly. Okay, so I think he will watch with. Oh, Daddy doesn't want to do that. Listen to Daddy and play with the nesting block. Okay, we'll do that. Where, where, where's... <laughs> okay. Oh, communication skills going up. That's all the talking. That's good. Oh, he looks so sweet, doesn't he? Huh? Big bright blue eyes, the winning smile. Oh, he's a proper little charmer. But I'm not sure. I'm not sure Daddy's up to it. Really? And? <laughs> Come on, Daddy, give me more. Give me more. Okay. Uh, okay. So Barbie is not the first C student at Landgrab Elementary, and he surely won't be the last. Wouldn't the weekend be a great time for her to bump her grades up? Well, it probably would. But um, I can't help with that, I'm sorry. Where is she? She's going to have a nap. Does she not sleep during the daytime? Can they, can they not sleep at daytime? I don't know. 
Anyway, how's Bar Barney doing? Oh, he's doing fine. Look at that. Loads of green needs. Skills going up. Are we going to get our first level five? Oh dear, Daddy sounds a little bit exhausted of all this effort. Kisana, yaba no boojing, would you? Come on, Daddy. <laughs> yep. Ah, uh, Palingo. <laughs> yeah, I think they. Oh no. Steve, Steve. That's it. For a moment there, I thought they'd run out of things to talk about, but uh, apparently not. And why have I just gone into the? Oh, because I've got the walls up. That's why. <laughs> Come on, hurry along, hurry along. Oh, is Daddy tired? It looks like he is, but... Oh, what's this? What's this? What's this? Did I hear something? All these good-sounding noises. Ah, Daddy's gone. Okay. So he's going to play dolls. That's fine. He can do that. He's reached level three of movement. Oh yes, so he can now whoops come back here. That was the wrong thing to press. Uh can now walk faster and dance. Oh, we like dancing. Dancing's good. Oh, right, so the dolls is communication and imagination, is it? Yeah. Hello. Where's that music coming from? Ah, I've recently, um, there was um, a sale on somewhere. Amazon, was it, I think? <clears throat> and City, City Living was, was on sale. Um, so I've, I've bought that. Just to see what happened, which is why you, we saw that little notification about the Spice Festival. Oh, did we get a Spice Festival in Windenburg? Waterside Warble. Is Waterside Warble here, or do I have to go to some other weird town? I'll just check my map. Ooh, loading screen. Come on, there we go. Um... Oh, you can't rotate. You can't. <laughs> I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm still so used to The Sims 3. I was thinking, oh, I could, I could just uh, rotate the map and see things in a different orientation, but uh, apparently we can't. Um, well, unfortunately, because uh, I've got Barney here selected, perhaps if I select a grown-up, the map will do more interesting things for me. Narwhal? No, no, quite. These, this, I can't, were all these here in, um, I don't think we've actually gone around Windenburg properly yet, have we? We've kind of been housebound. Um, no, I'm not seeing a Spice Festival anywhere around here. No, so it looks like I would have to go out of this town, um, which Barney can't do, I think. Can he? I wonder... Hmm, interesting question. Why do I keep pressing that when I need to press something else? I'm not sure. All right, Barney. What are you doing? Watching. Oh, I think he can talk to his sister. That'd be good. Um, talk. Join playing with, with dolls. So that should be good for communication. We're going to get at least, we must get at least one of these skills up to uh, to level five. Can't be much longer. But he's fully green now. Just a little. 100, 125. Uh, I'm I'm sorry. I don't understand how 125 is not full. 
Dr. EA have um, difficulty with numbers, with mathematics. I'm, I'm confounded and confused. All right, let's read a book, shall we? Which one shall we read? Um, squares, squares, a new princess, monkey brown and the monkey bars. Yes, let's read that. What will that do? More movement, communication. I think that that's just stuck there now. There's something going on. Oop, and down he goes. So how does he? Uh, how does he like reading? It's good for him. Good for his imagination, I think. I'm confused by these green bars. Something very strange going on. Hello, what was that dramatic noise for? <laughs> He's angry again. Why is he angry? Oh, he wants a... I think he'll have a nap on the, on the sofa there. But now he's happy. He's learned something new. Has he learned something? I don't understand. Okay. Uh, looks like oh, Amy Bond has brought Amy Bond has brought home some money. That's cool. So he's just going to have a nap on the sofa. Oh, but he is hungry again. Hmm. It's a thing with babies, and there she is. She tends to stand out there for a while when she gets home from work. Maybe she just needs to sort of um, recharge her batteries before getting stuck into the problems and the issues with the with the kids. Everyone's asleep. <laughs> this, is a... this is strange. Mm. I'm hoping that when I load the game again for the next episode, the communication will be f more... 200... What's going on? Who's he talking to? Me? Is it me talking? Is that is what I don't understand? Is that what's giving him the communication boost? Oh, he's ang angry again. Oh, it's because he's hungry. He's still a bit tired. All right. <laughs> Can he burst in on his dad? Um, yeah, I think he should. If I can, can I click on Daddy? There he is. Um, bath, please. No. Go away. No. Help. Food, please. Here he comes. He loves getting angry. It's the hunger thing again. I think he's a bit quicker on the stairs. That movement is now level three. Well, we we saw that earlier, didn't we? That's hardly news. It's really good. I mean, he he he's being understood now by his parents now. Oh, communication is now ninety four percent complete. I don't understand. I'm completely confused. Uh, well. Oh, I didn't check what he was eating earlier. It looked like some sort of toasted sandwich. Grilled cheese, perhaps? What's Adam going to provide him with today? What's that? Apple sauce. Okay. Not the most nutritious of meals, I would have thought, but it's better than nothing, I suppose. Right. Now he's got a bladder need here, as well as the, the need to go to bed. Oh, it's, it's half past ten at night. He's well past his bedtime. Very lax parenting once again. So I think what we'll see, once he's done that, I think we'll use the diaper. Oh, 
I just said that, didn't I? I'm sorry, I meant nappy. We use this nappy to get rid of the uh, to get rid of the bladder issue. Oh, there we go. That's better. Oh, that feels much more comfortable. Yes. <laughs> just love that look. Concentration. Yep. Thank goodness you can't see the little damp patch in the front of his jeans. <laughs> yep. Where was Daddy up to? Yep. Is he going to get to taken to bed? Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, can he get? Um, let's change the nappy. Is that going to happen? What's, what's happening here? Well, I think he's doing... Well done! Well done. Okay. Um, I think... Ooh, where's he going? No, don't, we don't want a nap. We'll actually go to... Uh, to bed. Uh, drink? No, we don't need any of that. Oh, I need to click the bed, don't I? That's the trick. <laughs> So we'll get story time again from Mummy. Let's, uh... Oh dear. Yeah, I think we're interrupt <laughs> interrupting his parents in, in the bathroom. Oh, well, never mind. So it looks like we are another successful day. We've made some improvement in imagination and movement and possibly communication. I really have... No idea. Right, we're getting more imagination improvement. So we see Barney off to bed again. So this will bring this episode to a close. Uh, again, a day of modest success. For Barney, at least. Uh, poor old Barbie, though. Oh, is she asleep now? Oh, at last, the bliss that she must be feeling at being able to sleep in a full night sleep in her own bed. That is just lovely. Good. So thank you very much for joining me today. Hope you've enjoyed this little exercise in madness, <laughs> parental madness, if nothing else. Uh, we've got a few days left. Um, where is he? Uh, I need to check this, don't I? Day still age up seven. I'm, well, we'll see. I might force that um, if we get his... No, that's I'm looking at Barbie. Days one. Oh, my goodness. Right, we are running close. Yeah, we're going to have to get uh, Barney fully equipped for, for childhood in the next episode. So I hope you can join me for that. And the best way of, of doing that, of making sure you don't forget, because I, I know you don't want to forget, um, is by subscribing to the channel. So if you've not done so, or done so already, just click that subscribe button and then you'll be told, hopefully, uh, whenever I upload another one of these or any of my other Let's Play series. And of course, if you've got anything to say, comments, suggestions, recommendations, critics, criticisms, anything you've got to say, just drop a note in the comments box below. But other than that, thank you very much again for joining me today, and I hope to see you in the next episode. But from me, Ajax Post, here in The Sims 4, until then, bye-bye for now.